Alright, uh, grab it here again. Yeah, well, it's uh, time for some more unboxings. So now I'm investing a little bit more into the uh, production side of the equipment. So I'm invested in a flexible tripod. Let's have a look and see what it looks like. It's a flexible tripod so the one can adjust the legs wherever one wants. And then we have this so that works like that. Sorry for the machine sound. I didn't close the garage door. Usually it's very quiet around. So okay, so it has a um, adjust the legs, and then one can um, tighten it up. This one should have taken a different angle on the, on the camera because this is not showing it very well. Okay. And then this here does what? Not really 100% sure what this one does. So, take my camera. really decided if I should keep the straps on the camera or not, but they're not very easy to take on and off. I haven't found an easy way to take the straps on and off on this camera. Okay. So. Ah, I know, it's to um, prevent it from turning, of course. So, yes. switch to oh, can't even see it properly in this picture. Dish shocks. What a crappy product view. Anyway, that's what it looks like. So this here locks it in place in terms of turning. And then this here. So that you can actually swivel it around. So anyway, that I thought I need because then I can actually use this um, this camera on uh, like closer work. Well, I can possibly set this camera and other cameras up to actually take to be very close, so I don't have to have a tripod, and, and it's very hard to get them to stand up just on these little bit smaller um, tripods, and, which I have a few, but I, they're they're a bit too small. The ones I have. Only about that high. And one can be very creative in setting up where the legs are positioned. Oh, that doesn't seem to hold. So, okay, there's limits to how angle one can have on the legs, so they can still, still support the camera. Oh, a little bit of testing required. I think it'll be better than the solutions I've been using so far. Okay, so that was, um, that was that one. If you found it interesting, consider subscribing, hit the bell icon, 
to get notifications on new videos. But anyway, I'm just happy if you ended up watching this one, get some more information. Come back from time to time and check for, for new videos. See you in the next one.